standing here with Rich from Da Vinci Boas, and you know what, I always like to, to interview people when I see new stuff. I saw the word Kraken. Now I think Kraken, I think Clash of the Titans. Mm -hmm. Explain to me what this boa is and what this morph is, because this is something new that I don't think a lot of people have seen. Maybe you can move it into the light here so people can see that. This is the actual super form of the Kraken. Um, the reason I named it the Kraken is because they look like octopus tentacles. Do you see the red dots uh, going yeah, down the side? Yeah, 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 yeah. That is pretty cool. Now, this um, is a patternless boa, right? The super form is patternless. The normal Kraken itself kind of looks like an Arabesque or a Key West, mm -hmm. the ladder back. It's got very thin connecting lines, the, the very regular. Very thin, yeah. So this um, is a Kodom mutation, correct. obviously. Right, this is the super form. You get Krakens if you breed this. Mm -hmm. um, the coloration is crazy, and we're, we're excited about the project because it's gorgeous. we want to put it into other morphs, like the Bloods and the IMGs. And, what, would a, you know, what would a Blood version of this even look like? I can't even imagine it. Increase this by 10. I mean, that's all we can do is just add more color to everything. And there's no albino in here. No, this is an oh, albino. this is an albino Kraken. This, is, this okay. is a Sun Glow Super Kraken is what this is. Okay. So this is a Hypo Albino gotcha. Super Kraken. And but so, adding blood into this is just going to make it more red. Of course it will. It's, yeah. so that's going to take about six years to do, I would think, right? We'll see. It could, it could be done sooner. What, what else would you like to see in this, obviously, in, um, in this uh, morph? What would, what would you think would really bring this out? Maybe Leopard, possibly? Possibly. Leopard, Jungle, Motley, pretty much all the Kodan morphs that are on the table right now. Um, just intensifies this. It's a pattern morph, but it's also a colored morph. Now, this must be exciting to have something that no one else in the, really in the country yeah, has, exciting. or only a couple people do. Yeah, yeah. I, I invested into it. I was um, I was grateful that they let me into the project, and right. there's only three people that have them. Mm -hmm. So I'm assuming I'm these are excited. not for sale. No. Yeah. Not for sale. Yeah. You have two of them, and there's only two in the whole country, you told me, right? Well, two of the supers the that I have, and um, Scott and Jason have the other ones. There's only a couple other super mm -hmm. sunglows, but they're super hypos, super normals, albinos, sunglows. Now, how can you tell they're super hypo, too? Um, well, the super hypo is more reduced pattern. Mm -hmm. um, their tongues are a little more bicolored than normal, uh, more faded out in the mm -hmm. pattern. Right. But you can't tell with this because mm -hmm. of the albino gene. Gotcha. So, and one more thing I want to ask you about. I, I, sure. I saw the IMG sure. Sun Glow here, which is the T positive Sun Glow. It's just awesome. I mean, the color, I can't even describe the color in that. Yeah. What will this look like as it gets older? As we know, when the IMGs get darker and darker. What will this look like as it gets well, older? Well, uh, Tony Antonucci actually produced these um, last year, so we don't know what they're going to look like. There's only a, hand, uh, only a couple of them in the country. Right. He's not turning black like you would think an IMG would turn yeah, black. Yeah, he's got like weird coloring. So I'm thinking he's probably going to keep this base color. His sides might go black, mm -hmm. but he's going to keep most of the color that he has. Um, Tony has another one that's lighter than this, but this one's turning more black. What an unusual head too, and the yeah. eyes is just, just yeah, wacky. You got some very cool stuff here. Thank you very much. I see you got some carpets too. Huh? What would you say are your coolest carpets? Oh man, we breed the jungles, the zebras, the jungle zebras. And my the wife jags. loves that the zebras. Yeah, very cool stuff. And we're crossing all these, you know, making some cool morphs. Mm -hmm. We have some albinos and sunglows coming next year. Cool. So great talking to you, man. Absolutely. Thanks, man. You're welcome.